going on YouTube welcome back to my channel so we just finished up a three game series against Kansas City and we took that series two games to one so today we're starting a four game series against Mike Trout and the Angels and for today's matchup is Lucas Giolito versus Julio Tehran so I hope you guys are enjoying if you do hit that like button and if you're new please subscribe to the channel thanks a lot for watching we are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Chicago White Sox and the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. Now at the plate, Danny Mendick. He'll get us started in this one Leading under the, the lights. The, White Sox, the second baseman, Danny Mendick. First offering on its way. Now this is popped up. Room, however, behind the plate for Castro. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for route number one. So here's Yohan Moncada. He comes in after a day of rest yesterday, so we'll see if it did him any good. Just does manage to get a piece there as this is bounced foul. Not a bad night to bring the parka along. 54 degrees at game time. Boy, that's just about in the catcher's glove there. It's 0-2. Inside as that perhaps will back him off a bit. 1-2. and two. Now here's the pitch. Swung on in the dirt. Strike three. Castro gathers. And the throw to first is there to record the second out. That is good. At the plate, Jose Abreu. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Now here's the pitch. Now Abreu connects deep to left. Gone! Boy, this guy's hot right now. Hit a bomb yesterday and hit another tape measure shot today. When he gets hot, he hits him in bunches. This could be the beginning of one of those extended hot streaks. Edwin Encarnacion now. The designated hitter. Edwin. As he rips it on the ground to second. And that's through for a hit. That is it. The left fielder. Aloy. So now to the plate, Jimenez. Eloy Jimenez. Just gets a piece of it, strike one. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Ready with the 0-1. And he jumps at a changeup, a swing and a miss. Wow, great pitch right there, right? Changing speeds. How about that straight changeup? How about that swing? Howdy, if you're waving at me. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. Fouled off. The one two. I got to count two. Well, two straight fastballs inside haven't put him away, so now it'll be interesting to see what he turns to. This one's outside, quite a bit off the plate that time. Well, this has been a good at bat. He's now worked to count full to three and two. Threw it right past him, a swing and a miss at the gas, and that ends the inning. Now at the plate, Andrelton Simmons. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Here's the pitch. Called a strike on the outer half, 0-1. And it's fouled away. 0-2 count, here's the pitch. Line drive to left. And that'll hop over the wall out there as he starts the home first with a ground rule double. Into the box now, David Fletcher, as he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. High and deep down the left field line. Jimenez will get there as he makes the catch in foul territory for the first down. Stepping into the box, Anthony Rendon, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. And it's the outside corner, it's strike one. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now, it's strike two. Guess who tipped their hand, they were sitting all over a piece of cheese. He flew open on the front side. 
And a liner foul into the seats down the right side. Simmons, the runner at second with one away. Hit the other way out toward right field. Garcia is there, two down. So a runner in scoring position with two men gone. And standing in, the ever-dangerous Mike Trout. He's set, here it comes. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. And this one bounds around against the wall. As he arrives at second without a play, as a run comes across to score on the play, tying the ball game. In now, Max Stassi. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. He did not play last night, but clearly back in the starting nine for this one. Sky down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. From the stretch, the one-two. Strike three called as he can't get the bat off his shoulders. Side retired. And that'll bring up the shortstop, Tim Anderson. Career numbers against Julio Tehran. A handful of plate appearances, and he's gone four for six. Up and away to start the inning. It's one and oh. too much bite on the breaking ball that time as it's well off the outside the 2-0 on the way high fly ball out to straightaway center Trout has to roam straight back but he has it for the first out so coming to the plate Luis Robert he had a homer in the ball game yesterday afternoon ready with the first pitch here it comes Here's a slider to start things out. Looked at for ball one. Now a ball lined to the left side. But foul. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with the bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. Here now the 2-2. Lifted in the air to center. Trout has a read on it. And that's the second out of the inning. Now in the box, Leori Garcia. Day off for him yesterday, but back out there for this one. First pitch coming. Here it is. Two out, nobody on. A ball and a strike. One of the best ways to keep a guy uncomfortable is to pound him inside. They're doing that, and this one caught the zone. And they'll go off speed here as this pitch misses. It's two and one. And it's two balls and two strikes now. Hey, I'd like to see a little bit more discipline in that. You get a count in your favorite, he's swinging a pitch that bad? Not good. Here's one that misses inside, and the count's run full now. Three and two. Frozen on the fastball. Never had a chance, and the inning is over. Justin Upton, the next to hit. He's ready for his first at-bat of this early season contest. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. And that one swung on and missed, going one. Looking at his career totals, Upton comes into action carrying a slugging line above 470. Obviously a potent hitter looking to do some damage right here. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. And he missed with it. It's 1-2. and two. He didn't look overly fooled right there because a lot of pitchers will go to the breaking stuff 0-2, but he certainly looked ready for a breaker on that pitch. Making the play over there is Abreu for the first down. Next batter to the plate, Brian Goodwin. He's ready for his first at-bat of this early season contest. Down and away, one ball and no strikes. A high strike there, and it's one and one. A ball and two strikes now. Two strikes. Fastball right back to the mound. And he'll just flip this on to first for the second out of the inning. 
Standing in, Jason Castro. He enters play, hitting in the 260s for the year. And he misses inside with that one, ball one. And maybe a little frustrated on the mound here as the fastball misses for ball two now. It's a lot easier to hit when you're putting yourself in good hitter's counts. This guy's done a great job not swinging at pitcher's pitches. And when he's getting the ball in the zone, he's getting the barrel to it. He's been hot lately. Three and one to him now. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Not the ideal location for a changeup up in the zone, but he got away with it. Fouled away. Good battle here. This will be the seventh pitch coming up. Swing and a miss for strike three. Hold the string on him that time, and the inning is over. And here's the switch hitting catcher, Yasmani Grandal. And he'll start out there half of the third, top of the order to follow. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And he throws the fastball by him here, 0-1. Barely able to make contact. Down 0-2 now. Nothing in two count. And the pitch. That's inside and low. It's a ball and two strikes. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. Well, he kind of got caught chasing the first two pitches out of the strike zone. But I think he's caught on to their game a little bit right now. Two tough pitches that he took with two strikes. And now the count is two and two. And this is taken in by Upton for the first out. Upton. Standing in, Danny Mendick. His last at bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. Here's the first pitch to him. And that's by him. It's 0-1. Well, he kind of tipped his hand right there. His approach is obviously sitting on the off speed because he was so late on that first pitch heater. One out, nobody on. Lofted in the air out toward right center. On the run is Goodwin. He gets there, and that's the second out. Next to bat will be the Cuban import, Yohan Moncada. Looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Not surprisingly here, this is on the ground to the right side. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Digging in now, Tommy LaStella, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. The first baseman. And now a pitch on the way. And that misses ball one. And he fouls this one off. Two balls and a strike to the Angels' first baseman. Fouled off. The 2-2. Two -two. Right side and right into the shift. Anderson picks it up. Throw on to first in time, one away. So there's the first out here in the Angels' third. And standing in, one of the best two-strike hitters in baseball, Andrelton Simmons. And he lays off there, 1-0. And he lays off a fastball here that looked pretty good, but it's 2-0. Two, two balls and a strike to count to Andrelton Simmons. The count now at 2-2. Two and, two. and now a pitch on the way. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. In now, David the Fletcher. Base First pitch Good on its pitch. way. Watcher. Ball one, no strike. Bases are empty here with two men out. Two oh, and oh now. Right. And he gets this fastball over. It's two and one. Two ball, one strike. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And he just couldn't keep that ball fair as it winds up a long foul ball. 
Man, the batter's eyes lit up right there. A hang. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Riding in, Jose Abreu. He went deep in his first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. And now, pitch on the way. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Abreu just rakes left handed pitching. There's no real way to dispute that. However, he's not nearly as proficient when facing pitching from the right side. One ball and two strikes to count. Ground ball right side. And that is through into right field for a single. Now that designated hitter, Edwin Encarnacion. Edwin Encarnacion to the plate now. And he'll watch one miss up and away for a ball 1-0. And a fastball in there for a strike. One and one. Just behind the fastball there. Two strikes now. Swing and a miss on the fastball. And that's the first out. So a runner at first with one man gone. And up next, the exciting Eloy Jimenez. From the stretch. Ball one as the changeup misses well off the inside. The Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. Here comes the 2-0 pitch. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Team's been struggling on offense. Let your D work for you right here. Pound the zone. This is foul right side. He's set. Here's the three and two. Base hit. Line drive into the corner. And this will find the wall deep in the corner. And they're going to hold him to a single here as they do a nice job of getting it back in quickly. And the next to bat will be Tim Anderson. As he'll take a look at ball one. Hit hard on the ground to second. And that is down for extra bases as this will get one home and maybe two. Up next to Chicago, the center fielder, Louise to the plate now, Luis Robert. As he connects on the first pitch with a fly ball to center. Trout has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. Settling in now, Leori Garcia. First time up, he went down looking. Yeah, Matty, and he was locked up by a good fastball for strike three last time. I'm interested to see if they attack him the same way. Come at him with hard velo late, or snap something off in the dirt to see if he'll fish. Line drive to center field. That's in there. Base hit. And the second run will score. It's now a four to one ball game. Now back. Here's the catcher, Yasmani Grandal. As he'll get out ahead of a changeup and swing through it for strike one. Now fastball here, not close, and it's one and one now. He broke out the slide step there, Danny. Yeah, he's clearly thinking about the steal right here. Didn't happen, but the cat-mouse game continues on. And this one's in the dirt. Runner holds as the count moves to two and one. As a look, now the pitch. Line drive, fair ball down the line. And now this is thrown wildly, just getting it into the infield. And as a result of that errant throw back in, he'll advance 90 feet here and move up from second to third. Danny Mendez. Into the box, Danny Mendez. 
as he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. That evens it up one and one. And did he go around? No, he did not. Ball two. Great chance right here as a hitter to be really aggressive. With two guys already on, pretty good shot. He's going to get a challenge pitch right here. Three and one to him now. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. And a check swing here as he couldn't help himself. And it's ruled strike two. Had to sit back on the changeup. And he did a good job to get the bat on that one. The next three, two. Hit hard on the ground is short. Taken in by Simmons. On to second for the force out, and the side is retired. Now at the plate, Anthony Rendon. And he flew Rendon. out in his last at bat. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Pitcher wants to have a quick inning right here, capitalize on the momentum his batters have. Taken in by Abreu, and a step on first for the out, three unassisted. And now for the Angels, Mike Trout. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, he jumped all over that first pitch last time up. Interested to see if he has the same approach this AB. Counts even to Trout, one and one. Four to one our score as we play inning number four. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. Hey, after the double is first at bat, looks like he's trying to pitch. Meanwhile here, this ball's given a pretty good ride out to deep left field. And that is going to clear the wall. A home run. Stepping in now, Max Stassi. He swings and grounds it to short. And that'll get by into center field for a base hit. Here's Justin Upton now. As he'll swing and miss it, a first pitch slider at strike one. One in, one out, and one on here in the inning. And Upton won't chase that one. It's one and two. Step out of the box, take a deep breath. After. Great effort on the dive, but it's through into left. The right fielder, At the plate, oh, yeah. Brian Goodwin. And there's a swing and a miss at an off-speed pitch to start him out. Nothing in one. Big breaker that time as it catches the inside for a called strike. Now this is on the ground at first. We'll see if they can get two. One there. Throw back to Abreu. They get them both, and the side is retired. New inning set to get underway. Into the box. Yohan Moncada. Third trip to the plate for him here. He struck out and grounded out in his first two tries. And he'll start the inning with a pitch that misses off the plate. It's ball one. Well, he's still out there to start the fifth inning, but it's been a real grind of a start for him. The pitch count is much higher than he'd like it to be, so it's hard to imagine him working really deep into this game. Trout comes on now, and he has it one down. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And one of the more prolific RBI men in the league the last few years, Jose Abreu, will bat next. Lifted in the air to straightaway center. Trout is there now, and he has it, two gone. So bases are empty here with two gone, and that will bring up the power bat of Edwin Encarnacion. Pitch on the way. In his career, Encarnacion comes into play with a slugging percentage over 490, just shy of 500. So he's looking. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Striding into the box, Jason Castro. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Now here's the pitch. Well below the knees, laid off on the changeup there. Now it's 2-0. Oh. 
you can see this guy's more focused at the plate right now. In that first A.B., he went down on strikes. And it's fouled away. Sent foul again, and after being way ahead, now it's even at two and two. Trying to send him packing for the second time. There's a ball low. He misses with a changeup. You do not want to walk the eight-hole hitter. It just opens up so many options. Do we bunt them over to second with the nine-hole hitter? Do we try and play for that big rally with the top of the order coming up? This is a huge pitch. You can't allow this guy to walk. He throws him on the fastball there. Jason Castro is retired for the first out in the bottom half of the fifth. Tommy LaStella is at the plate as he watches ball one. High in the air down the right field line. And foul. And it's one and two. Four and two our score here as we play inning number five. Fouled away. Well, somebody's sitting off speed right here. Only way he was late on that heater is he was expecting another changeup. Fielded by Abreu, and he'll step on first himself for the out. So it's back to the top of the order now. And standing in, one of the best two-strike hitters in baseball, Andrelton Simmons. And a strike called at the knees, nothing in one. High in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Here's the center fielder. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Dylan Bundy takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Ready for another chance? Emo Jimenez, a hit in two tries so far. Outfield shaded a bit to left center, the first pitch. And that one's in on the hands to start the inning. It's ball one. Two balls and no strikes to the White Sox left fielder. Now the 2-0 home. The count now at 2-1. Now here's the pitch. And this one's going to bounce up to the plate. And easy take there. It's 3-1 now. Tim Anderson waits on deck. Now a swing and a deep drive to left. Gone to lead off the inning. Hey, listen, there's an old adage in baseball that solo home runs won't kill you. This is one of the top hitters in that lineup. So a home run, a solo home run right here, is not the end of the world. At the plate now, Tim Anderson. As the first pitch to him is taken low and away for ball one. A hit in two at-bats for him at this point in the ballgame. This one's outside quite a bit off the plate that time. Ready with the 2-0 pitch. Hit hard towards center. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Now back, the center fielder. Louis standing in now. Luis Robert as he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. No hits to this point. Now a curveball, but he might have flown open a bit. It's one and one. A ball and two strikes. Ooh, not a spot you expect a curveball. He's lucky he missed because... That's the kind of pitch that gets hit out of the ballpark. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. So striding forward now, now Leori Garcia. In his last appearance, he singled home a pair of runs. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Well hit. Deep down the right field line. And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul, so a missed opportunity there. Now the 0-1. And they pitch out here, but nothing's going on. Five runs, nine hits, and no errors so far for the White Sox. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. Two and two. Good thing he didn't make contact with that pitch. Only thing he could do is probably hit that on the ground. It could be a double play ball. 
grounded to the right. And that'll get on through into right field for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Now batting. Pepper. Yusmani Grandal. So now to the plate. Yusmani Grandal. As he looks at a fastball that misses off the plate for ball one. There's the fastball that gets the lower part of the zone called for a strike. 1-1. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And nearly a three-run shot. Instead, it's a foul ball. The 1-2. Nope. That's inside. For the guy on the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. And he takes ball four, so a good job out of the nine hole in getting on base as we go back to the top of the order. Second base, Danny Mendez. He set and the pitch. And this will find the seats behind the first base dugout. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. And the curveball bounces here, but a good job behind the plate to keep it at arm's length. And this is swung on and missed. Oh, a huge punch out there as the bases remain loaded with two away now. The third baseman, Yohan Montana. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Yohan Moncada is in with two away as he takes a ball. 1-0. 1-0. Oh. Oh. Here it is. A pretty aggressive pitch right there up in the zone. Surprised he didn't offer at it. On that fastball is too much for him there. 1-2. He's got a chance to ring up back-to-back -back case here, and that would be huge in this situation. Got him. So the damage winds up not being as bad as it could have been as they'll strand the bases loaded. The side is retired. At the plate, David Fletcher. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. First pitch of the at-bat. David. On one. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Slow roller down the third baseline. Mokata has it. And that's out number one. And digging in next will be Anthony Rendon. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Line drive to left. Oh, and he misses it. He's through first and hustling for second. Runner at second now as a result of the error. And at the plate will be the speedy outfielder, Mike Trout. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. A 1-0 delivery. There's the big breaking ball, and it's by him for a strike. That's an awesome 12-6 hook right there. Look at the depth, spin rate, nasty downward tilt on that pitch. Taken in by Abreu. And he'll take this one to the back for the out. But meanwhile, the runner will move up 90 feet to third base. Stepping up now, yeah, Max that, Stassi. Runner in scoring position with Sukhan. Here's the first pitch to him. They'll try and entice him with a high fastball, but he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. That misses 2-0. and oh. Now 2-0 and oh with a great hitter up, a runner on third and two outs. This is not the spot where you want to be challenging a hitter like this. This is where you have to pitch. Very careful. And he missed with it there. Ball four. It's a two-out walk with the runner still at third. Trying to hang a zero. Here's the pitch. Lays off 1-0. and And a strike to even the count. One and one. Well, the Angels have been searching for that big hit pretty much all game. It remains to be seen if they can. Well, the play's been made, and that retires the side. 
So here's the slugging first baseman, Jose Abreu, now. He'll lead it off here as we begin inning number seven. Abreu. Now the pitch. And this is a fastball that's right on the black, but ruled a ball. It's 2-0 now. Well, this is a spot you'd like to be in. 2-0, good hitter. He's going to turn it loose right here. The 2-1 is taken. Ball three. Well, ball three here. Hey, and the White Sox would love to start it in and get that leadoff guy on. They'd love to get a leadoff walk right here. And a good take there as they'll have a leadoff man aboard to start the seventh. It's ball four. First delivery to him on the way. Didn't quite catch the zone there. Ball one. I'll tell you, it's a helpless feeling for a manager or a pitching coach when your pitchers are having a really hard time throwing strikes. What are you supposed to do other than keep trying new guys until someone starts attacking the zone? A ball and two strikes now. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. Well hit, but also well fouled into the seats and left. On a good curveball, gets him swinging for wrap number one. Now with the plate, Emo Jimenez. He homered earlier and is two for three to this point. Yeah, man, this guy flexed his muscles in that last at bat. We heard that he has good power. That last bomb had to go well over 400 feet. He hit it a long way. See, guys, he is human. Occasionally an ugly swing right there. But he's having a monster one one. season, so I'm going to give him a free pass. One and one the count. Has a look, now the pitch. There's a breaking ball, but it's laid off and doesn't find the zone. I'd be real surprised if he goes back out away there on the mound. This is a count for a fastball challenge, and we'll see if he's ready for it in the box. Lestella will get there as he's able to tuck this one away just past the first base dugout for route number two. So it's a runner at first with two men out. And up next, it'll be Tim Anderson. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Uh, chased after that one, and it's nothing and one. Back up the middle and in for a base hit. Jaime Maria will get the ball here as he now looks back. to get the final out in the top of the seventh. Robert. Into the box now, Luis Robert, as he'll take a look at a slider here that misses for ball one. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. In the dirt, and now let's see... Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. 5-2 our score as we play inning number seven. And he fouls this one off. Misses, ball two. Throws him for strike three, and that retires the side. Dylan Cease gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seven. So striding in, Brian Goodwin. He's rolled into ground outs a couple of times already here in the ballgame. Oh, and that one slung through the strike zone that time at 98, 0-1. Probably a design take right there. They need base runners, so they're going to make them try to bring the ball in the strike zone. The 1-1. One, one. It's taken for strike two. 
Cease is a guy that certainly fits the profile as a power fastball pitcher, but I think what makes him really most impressive is the command he displays while keeping the velocity as high as it is. Man, that's one of those. How could you not swing at that one? A good take there on that pitch. Lined into right, a base hit. Now that the catcher, Jason Castro. Jason Castro, the catcher, is in as he takes a fastball off the plate for a ball 1-0. Oh. 0 oh for 2 from him so far in this one. 1-1 one one to Jason Castro. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Waiting on it is Jimenez. One away. So one away now for the Angels in the seventh. And that'll bring in Tommy LaStella to bat next. Here's the first pitch to him. And that's high for a ball, 1-0. and oh. Looked like a breaking ball there, but it missed badly, 2-0. Now, this is the kind of count this guy. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that ball will stay fair, and it's gone. A home run. The batter, number two. Good job. Andrew Fair. Simmons. In now is Andrelton Simmons. And this pitch is up and in as he backs away. It's ball one. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. And a breaking ball falls in there for a strike. It's one and one. That's the perfect pitch after you've just brushed the guy back. The hitter probably isn't sitting up there thinking you're going to flip something soft up there. Throw gets him. Two down. Stepping in, David Fletcher. He got on top of one and was a ground-out victim last time. Fletcher. First delivery to him on the way. Hey. Oh, one's the count. The wind up and the 0-1. Oh, one and the one. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Lifted in the air out to left. Giving chase is Jimenez. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Digging in the switch hitter, Leori Garcia. He steps in off a base hit in his last at-bat. Leori Garcia. Here comes the first pitch. Now a swing and a miss at a slider for a strike. Gets the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0-2. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. Wow. I love to watch a guy who's not afraid to move a hitter's feet. You work inside like that, all of a sudden guys aren't likely to dive out, out over the plate. The 1-2. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Upton's under it. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Ready once again, Yosemite Grandal. One for two in the ball game thus far. First delivery to him on the way. Belted high and deep into right center. Back goes Trout. On the warning track, he makes the catch. So the lineup flips over and digging in, Danny Mendick. Struggling so far in this one and looking to erase his 0 for 4 ball game right here. Now a swing and a miss. Took something off that one and it's strike one. I can't speak from experience, but that's got to feel good right there. Throwing a nasty change up first pitch and getting a swing and a miss on it. Now he pretty much opened up any pitch in his arsenal. Hit sharply on the ground. And that's in for a base hit. Finally, make him one for five now. Now that's 
stepping in now, Yohan Moncada. He swings and sends a bullet to right field. Goodwin is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Jace Fry will come on and make now, his fourth appearance ball. in this campaign. Number 57, Jace Leading off the inning, Anthony Rendon. And they'll need him to get something going here. This and thing's far from over, even goal. though we're moving into the back the end of this pitch. game. Only Anthony down Green. by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. Fry is adjusting to the new normal, as MLB now mandates that relievers reach the end of an inning or face three or more batters before being replaced. And for a one-time lefty specialist like this, that's a big change. called here as with the potential tying run aboard they'll make the move to get a little more speed out there here's the center fielder Mike Trout as he'll take a breaking ball then off the plate for ball one so far two for three in this one one ball one strike to count four runs eight hits and no errors to this point for the Angels fouled off again and now he's in a one and two hole Another one sent foul. The one two. Misses ball two. Tough to take a pitch like that right there, especially in a one two count. You almost get in that auto swing mode. Great job to work the count back to even. Nobody out, runner on first. Hard liner to center field. Oh, and he misses it. And this one scoots all the way to the wall. Stepping in, Max Stassi, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. No balls in one strike. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. And a swing and a miss. A big strike out here, as it'll remain second and third, but with one away now. He's set, here it comes. Breaking ball that's cut on and missed for the first strike. Upton in a hole. 0-2 the count to him. Boy, I love the way he's competing out there on the mound right now. He's got a chance to rack back-to-back K's with two runners in scoring position. He's not giving in at all. So it's a backwards K on the changeup that time. Justin Upton goes down for out number two in the bottom half. Brian Goodwin is at the plate as he takes a cold strike one. Behind 0-2 now. And this one runs in on him as he can't get his arms extended. A great pitch there, and the inning is over. Stepping into the box, Jose Abreu. He'll lead things off here in this one-run contest. Jose Abreu. First pitch coming. Here it is. And we kick off the ninth inning with a swinging strike here. Nothing in one. You never want to take the aggression away from a ball player. But in this situation, I'd like to see the leadoff guy try and work the count a little bit more. Especially when this pitcher's missing like he is. So he goes back to back with the same pitch and got him to chase it both times. He's clearly not picking up that pitch very well. So he was confident in doubling up. Does he triple up on it? It's always tough to go back to back to back. It's not a good idea to show a good hitter the same pitch three times in a row. And he's going to make it. He's in at second base with a leadoff double. Now battle. The designated hitter. Edwin. In for at the plate, Edwin Encarnacion as he lays off a fastball too low for ball one. Looking at his lifetime numbers, Encarnacion carries a batting line a little over the 260 mark. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. Two and one. This is going to be an interesting at bat. I think he has to be pitching for a strikeout here, so we'll see what kind of sequence he uses. He's set, and the 2-1 pitch. In the dirt here. No advance here, but it's 3-1 and one now. Down, right 
Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. A swing and a liner to left center field, and that's going to drop in for a base hit. And this will bang up against the wall. On to second, but he's in safely as a run will score on the play as well. Next to Chicago, the left field. To the plate now, Elo Jimenez. Pitch is way outside, and he can't even get a glove on it. And he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. A ball and no strikes. Here it is. Hey, the bullpen needs to step up in this situation. I got to believe the manager was hoping for way more than this. High chopper to third. Fielded cleanly, and that's the first out. So a big spot here in stepping in, Tim Anderson. Although there are a couple of bases open, and we'll see if they think about working around him. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Owen won the count. From the belt, the pitch. Swing and a miss here, and he's behind in the count now, 0-2. This is a situation where you're going strictly for the strikeout. Infield in, and from the offensive standpoint, you're just trying to create hard contact and get it by that infield. Simmons is calling for it, and he makes the catch for the second out. Up next for Chicago, Luis Robert. He'll look to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, Matty, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Especially now, he's got a bear down. He gets the two strikes in this spot, has to put the ball in play. Strike one to start the at-bat. The 0-1 pitch. Boy, this is one of those ABs you like to hit the rewind button on. Put himself in a tough spot now, hitting with two strikes. Open to send him packing, pitch on its way. Well, all of the umpires in the seats thought that was strike three, and they weren't far off, but I think that was a good call. Looked to be just a bit outside. Now a ball lined to the left side, but this will be a foul ball. And a slider runs away from him there, and the count levels at two and two. hit in the air down the right field line but this is just going to wind up being a foul ball liner towards second throw to first in time and the big inning is avoided as the side is retired all set for the bottom of the ninth Stepping up to the plate, Jason Castro. He could really use a knock here 0 for 3 in the game so far. Alex Colome comes out of the bullpen to shut things down here in the ninth. Now pitching for Chicago. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. And he looks like he's toying with him here. It's 0 and 2. Got him, and he goes down on strikes for the third time. Ready to take his hacks again, Tommy LaStella, as he'll look to follow up the two-run homer he launched over the wall last time up. Out in front as this is pulled foul into the seats. The 0-1 pitch. Behind 0-2 now. Get the chainsaw out today, boys. If he's going to throw back-to-back -back cutters like that, we are going to have some guys getting some wood blown up in their hands. Knee high, he barehands it. And that's an incredible effort to get the second out of the inning. The batter, two. Now back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, Andrelton Simmons. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. No balls and a strike to count. And this will be a called strike two. And trouble now as they're down to their final strike tonight. Hey, it looks like this guy's going to work in the upper part of the strike zone. 
It'll be interesting to see if this lineup. He's got it, and the White Sox have taken game one of the series on the road as the ball game is over. Yeah, and they know this is going to be a tough stretch on the road. To win the first game of the series has got to feel pretty good. Something to build on for tomorrow. A 6-4 to four finish in tonight's affair. The Chicago White Sox took the lead in the fourth and held on until the end. Lucas Giolito earned his fifth win of the year. Alex Colome earns the save out of the bullpen, his eighth of the season. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com.